Academic excellence and grand mastery. Toma. Oye, chicos, esto para recuperar el verme de los crees. Eso que se rompe. Si nos resalta sus vasos baratos. Vamos a ver. Hello. Yes, I ever. I've got something marvelous to show you. It's the most powerful tool in your creative arsenal. <laughs> Come with me. Behold! Let's give the magnificent the puppet power select you move if you're in a menu but move your cursor over the orange area and onwards we'll go gently does it. unusually graceful and precise movements for a novi a lot of sack folk end up knocking something over or someone. you show promise Excellent! All evidence nicely removed. No one any the wiser.
If you've used your puppet cursor to select an object, you can use the... Try it out on this block here. You are a natural, <laughs> like your style. Yo sé este mundo. Paletilla, yo ya me conozco este mundo. If an object isn't work, just don't use it on the furniture. Especially if you're sitting on it at the time. Oh, the bruises. Nicely, nicely. Lovely, lovely. <laughs> Once you've selected something, if you want it similarly, you use the back shuffle. these things quite uplifting, you know. <laughs> Disaster! Stuck in a lift! You know how to fix it, right? Oh, I think this is all too easy for a budding genius like you. Open your pocket and select once you're replete with satisfaction. Y como puta pie, mierda, da, vamos a entrar. Ah, yo ya sé.
weapon you select once you're replete with satisfaction at it. Una pequeña, ¿sí? Me voy a poner una grande acá. First, now, to place your material, you know that saying, we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. Well, we've come to it. You smear a nice solid bridge across Yay! this gap, okay? Pikachu, Pika. Don't forget. Yeah, hang on, it's gone. Uh... Oh, yes. Don't forget, you can rotate the shape and alter its size with the right stick. Creo que es para... 
¿Cómo llegaste ahí? After you've selected a shape, you can use it to cut through existing material. Just hold down the delete button and move the shape to cut. Why don't you try it out on the material up ahead? Fancy a race? Let's pit your newfound skills against the clock. All you sack to begin, choose. Now you can apply this danger to a...
liking that. Liking that lots. Those sackbots have been sent back into the Imagisphere for recycling. <laughs> Nothing goes to waste up here. Now, suppose simply, if things are moving too fast when you want it. So, for example, if a sack use the appropriate hazard tool to help these sackbots reach the other side. Ah, made a little error, have we? Not a prob. You can always undo it with the left button. Then unpause everything with the up button. Not a prob. You can always undo it with the left button. Then unpause everything with the up button. Thing. And welcome to the danger department. Uh, don't let the name worry you. Nothing in here can harm you in any way at all. Uh, no, wait. Uh, sorry. Uh, everything in here can harm you in many different ways. <laughs> Dear, mind like a... like a... Uh, come on in. Don't be shy. Remember, what kills you makes you stronger. Something like that. Uh, what is wrong with me today? You sack folk asked to begin. Choose now, you can apply this danger to a mid. Liking that, liking that lots. Those sackbots have been sent back into the Imagisphere for recycling. <laughs> Nothing goes to waste up here. Supposing you want to make simply, if things are moving too fast when you want to...
Did I make it clear? A lethalized... So, for example, if a sackbot has been... Use the appropriate hazard tool to help these sackbots reach the other side. Now, horrible gap. Select the. Ho Don't worry about the sackbot. It's not alive. It's just an automaton that doesn't think or feel. It's like my old PE teacher. A gas has no real mass, so objects will just pass right through it, unlike solid walls. I often get the two mixed up. Oh, the bruises. Try it out here. Well, that's hazards dealt with. Now you know how to maim and kill like a pro. Uh, but not in a bad way. Lovely stuff. Onwards we go!
How do, Sack Thing? Really pleased with how your training is going. You've really turned a corner, so uh, let's edit that corner. You'll find the corner editor. Use the action button. Then I want you to use the left stick to... What an uncrossable gap this looks to be. But hold on, Da Vinci. Sack thing has the ability to bridge gaps, remember? Oh, you're right. Go to it, my woolly shortcut for the pros. Once you've selected a material with the corner editor, you can drag select multiple corners and move them all at the same time. Uh, but uh, keep it to yourself. Sometimes a corner is more trouble than it's worth. Oh, if that isn't good work, then my name isn't... Uh, whatever it is. Looks like you can corner edit and climb on this material. <laughs> huh. You're taking to this like a fish takes to whatnot. Splashy stuff. Uh, oh, you know. Impressive work. Double.
Yippee! You're back! As you know, I am the unforgettable... Uh... Ooh. Ah, Da Vinci, your puppet tutor. I am positively bouncing today, so let's talk about bouncing. Bounce pads. They're used, and once you've installed all your tweaks... Okay, Saki, it's time you lay down some bounce pads of your own. Excited? We keep the bounce pads in the tools bag. Select the little Tipplington for you. If you hold the action button down when you place your bounce pad, you'll go straight into the tweak menu. <laughs> it's a kind of shortcut thingy thing. Handy. Now, did you notice your bounce pad succumbed to gravity when you before here you can back out of ha huh. up here the laws of physics can take a run and jump and stay motionless in midair
You're doing ever so well, you know. You're a dream student. Ooh, can you do me a Freddy favor and use your Bouncypadium ability? Impressive work! 